Well, it's certainly going to shake up the medals table, isn't it? Great Britain will move up considerably. Oh. Jessica Long slinks onto the medal podium there. <laughs> Sachets. Well, Akeisha Patterson. It was a good swim from her. It's battled with her teammate Madison Elliott for the silver medal. Never really in contention for the gold. But it's been a good championships for her so far. And there we go, the, uh, the Highland Coup. Highland Coup, that's a good child. Got it. Yeah. Got it. The winner of the silver medal. Uh, well, loads and loads of tweets coming in. Tim Hollingsworth from the British Paralympic Association. Absolutely over the moon about Ollie Hines' performance. Here's Madison Elliott collecting her silver. And she's a, uh, well, she's an incredibly important member of the Australian relay team, isn't she, Paul? Like, you can almost see the relay team, her and maybe uh, Ellie Cole, they're sort of, the relay teams tend to be built around those two swimmers. Absolutely. And a very important part of the US relay team is Jessica Long continuing that long winning streak in this event, the 400 freestyle S8. It just seems incredible that we're talking about Jessica Long being slightly off her best, and this is her fourth gold medal. Yeah, absolutely. Sorry, I was slightly caught off guard there by a very happy uh, Chris Ferber, who is the GB team manager, is the national anthem of the USA. Madison Elliott hasn't leapt to try and knock Jessica Long down <laughs> like she did yesterday. Yeah, well, it's, it's becoming a th becoming a thing, isn't it? That when they whenever they go to have a uh, a congratulatory hug, Madison Elliott has to have at least a ten foot run up. 